Welcome to my YouTube channel. Ito po inyo Madang Vibes, Chika Dora ng Japan. At binabati ko po kayong lahat ng Happy Valentine's Day. May jowa man or wala. Happy Valentine's Day po sa inyo lahat. At dahil nga araw ng mga puso, ito ay aking tatalakayin. Kung ano nga ba ang pagkakaiba ng Valentine's Day ng Japan para sa ibang mga bansa or sa maging sa Pilipinas. So, samahan nyo na po guys para malaman na natin kung ano nga ba talaga ang pagkakaiba. ba? Diba? Alam niyo ba kung ano ang pagkakaiba ng Valentine's Day ng Japan kumpara sa ibang bansa o maging sa Pilipinas? Valentine's Day is known as the day when one expresses their love to that one special person. In Western countries, it is common for both men and women to participate in a gift exchange often the approaching date of february 14th poses men across the world to scramble trying to pick out a gift or plan the perfect date however in japan valentine's day plays out a bit differently Despite being a relatively new event in the country, Japan has its very own Valentine's Day customs and traditions. For starters, the roles are actually reversed and it is women who bear the pressure of giving gifts. The favor is then returned exactly one month later on March 14th on a day known as White Day when men are encouraged to give gifts back to the women who treated them on Valentine's Day. The differences do not end there. Valentine's Day became popular in Japan in the 1950s due in part to a few notable business campaigns particularly of confectionery that began selling heart-shaped chocolates during the season and a large department store that ran a valentine sale an idea that was followed by other department stores and continues to this day their target customers were women who were encouraged to buy beautiful and delicious chocolates for the men in their lives. The department store displays were elegant and the popularity continued to grow throughout the years. These days, Valentine's chocolates are more popular than they have ever been. Store displays have become increasingly elaborate, offering various tastes and styles of chocolates. The packaging is often just as exquisite as the chocolates themselves, and most department stores will offer gift wrapping services to make the chocolate gifts even more special. Prices range from modest to quite expensive another thing to note about valentine's day in japan is that women not only give chocolate to men for whom they have romantic feelings but also male family members and even co-workers however not all chocolate is considered equal and the type of chocolate given depends on the relationship the japanese have different words to describe the types of valentine's day chocolate 
given on Valentine's Day. Giri Choco are known as the obligation chocolates that are doled out to workmates, family members, and acquaintances. Typically, this type of chocolate is relatively cheaper and the present is no way considered a romantic gesture. Homemade choco are meant to be given to a romantic partner or a person for whom a woman has romantic feelings. In other words, homemade choco are love chocolates. Women often take great care to select homemade choco which is typically higher quality, more aesthetically appealing, and as such higher in price. Tomo Choco, not everyone celebrates romance on Valentine's Day and White Day. However, singletons need not despair. It is quite popular for women to give chocolates to their female friends as well. This is known as Tomo Choco. forget to like share subscribe and click the notification bell for more updates see ya